Random rare relic, upgraded card, enemies have 1 HP. Um, 1 HP is not really good, but it could be... It could be kind of ludicrous if I hit it, right? If I hit it here, could get a nice path. But a rare relic is a rare relic. Can't really say no to that, right? Oh, god, you can't say no to Dead Branch. It's been a while since I've had something disgustingly wonky. What's up, Siloam? And how you doing, uh, six on good Sunday evening indeed. It's a late stream, yep. So this is a free win. Uh, we got... I mean, this is Corruption Waiting Room. Let me just go restart the game so we don't mess up our sound. Armaments is cool because Armaments can upgrade the cards that Debris gives me. Alright, let me restart the game. Hello, my bad. There's a card called Corruption on the Ironclad that makes all skills free, right? And exhaust them. So imagine you're making everything free and exhausting them. Which basically means you're playing cards for free and getting insane value. And that was... Talk about order, real quick. I'm not perfect. This guy's 25 life. If I do this, it's gonna be 12, 22. RIP. 24, damn. All because I messed up that inflame. See, it bites you in the butt. But we got Havoc, so Havoc is like... It just gets the dead range going, and this is actually sick. Upgrade Havoc as well. This is actually as perfect as it can be. Look. Hello. Okay. So far, anticlimactic. Whatever. <laughs> hello. Oh, hello. Oh, sick. Oh, the poggers. Look at that. See, Dead Branch gives me the ability to do things like that. I've got another Havoc. Whoa. How many Havocs are we doing? So, I want to go either this path... I think we're gonna be double elite. We're, we're feeling it. By the way, Anthony, I just realized you changed Fission. I am a huge fan of it. I don't know if you saw the run or not. Or the... Bastardized finish to the run, but... Huge fan. Of the fission change. I'm gonna do Juggernaut. Although I'm taking way too much damage from this fight. God damn it. I'm not doing this myself. I made this so much harder for myself. Sever's soul. That's a way to just get Dead Branch all the way. I'll do it. I'll do it. I'm down. Havoc into Havoc into what the hell? Did, did Havoc go into Havoc into Infinite Blade, which hit Sever's soul? Like, what just happened? What did I just experience? I like, I like Dark Embrace, but I also kind of want to do a little bit of, uh, second wind. Uh, we'll do Dark Embrace. We'll, we'll keep it in the deck. That was funky. See, that's why Dead Branch is cool, because just don't know what the hell happens. Oh, wait, we have, yeah, Dark Embrace is actually insane in this fight. We should probably have played it. Armaments by weakness. I'm tempted. Anger. I'm not mad about that. Perfected strike and anger. 
Man. I like all of these things. Fire breathing for lethal? You don't say. Happy Flower is sick. So Scene Red is amazing because Scene Red allows you to get energy and then get a random card from Dead Bridge, right? It's amazing. But then you have Immolate, which is just... It's Immolate. What can I say? It's too good. What do you Immolate? It's actually... Oh, upgrade shit. that. Yo, thank you for the Twitch Prime. Oh, shaman. And Ice Fish, thank you for the resub five months in a row. I know, RFP run indeed, man. It's a shame. Oh, Warcry. Okay, cool. Have you searched your team for every productive way? I'm gonna do Havoc here. What is it gonna be? Havoc into Havoc? Why does it keep Havoc-ing my Havoc? I don't really appreciate that, actually. Let's do this instead. I should've done Fear Pot. That was my bad. Whatever. Damn, this, this, this sucks. Oh, hello. Back of the Charge is also another good card you want to add in there. Alright, beautiful. Two elite so far. Old coin, Searing Blow, Wild Strike. I'm gonna skip. Go for the third elite. I mean, at this point, we want to hit a shop. So we can try to. Let's see if this is a shop. Oh, I can't do that. I think I want to rest. Though, if we get the Triple Century, it's a free fight. And I think we are actually doing pretty well against the Gremlin Lab as well. But I'll rest just to be safe. Yeah, this should be a free fight. Evolve's pretty cool for this fight. Let's see what we get for Havoc. Um, let's do True Grit. Oh, it's another Emily. Wow. That's nice. Hit emulate. Oh shit, not like this. Oh, that, I get, yeah, yes, like this, yes, like this. Okay. Heavy Blade, Thunderclap, Flex. Hmm, who's the boss again? I think Thunderclap could be cool. Nah, we skip here. Chop! Oh my god. Okay, we got Stone Calendar, Apotheosis, Dolly's Mirror. Dolly's Mirror. How crazy would it be to do Dolly's Mirror for Havoc? That's really stupid. We're looking for corruption. We didn't find it. Actually, pretty bad shop. I mean, I guess we got True Grit. That's nice, right? That gives this. this I like that. Now, Apotheosis is not bad. Um, It does exhaust itself and it upgrades all my cards. Which means I can start resting more willy nilly. I, I, don't, I don't really like Apotheosis. I don't think it's not my it's not my jam. I think I actually like Stone Calendar in this fight though. I actually think Stone Calendar is pretty sick. I might end turns before that becomes a thing, but I actually think it's expensive. But in this boss fight in particular, and just even in certain fights, this is really nice. Expensive. It's really expensive. It's uh it's supposed to be 365, right? For yeah, for Stone Counter. It's okay. I guess we could do it. I could save for the next act as well. Because this fight's gonna be kind of taken over by Emily, I would say. Yeah, I think we wait. Although, yeah, I think Dolly's Mirror for the upgrade to Havoc is the dream. But $231 for another Havoc is like... Yeah, we just wait. Although Warcry is really good in Dead Branch deck. Because Warcry is another thing that can help you find corruption, right? It's the first time you're going to see me catching, taking Warcry like that. 
And power potions could be corruption, right? But I, I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. We're fine. I kinda like this. Because I don't want to take damage. But then it would have to draw into like ghostly armor for it to be no damage. I think this is just better. Seeing red would have been sick though. Alright. Power through? Huh. I like Happy Flower here. Very pot. I was gonna say steroid pot, but then we got corruption in my whole. Everything changes. Now, the problem with corruption is that you need something like to give it fuel, right? Like, you need a. Uh, what's it called? Something that generates cards when you run out of skills. So things like Reckless Charge. And you also need... Like maybe something like Power Through to give you wounds in which you could use as fuel to exhaust that. No, but that's not even the case because True Grit would get out of itself. So we need Reckless Charge and we need a... Uh, ah, Reckless Charge. Alright. Let's upgrade the armaments. I've seen Reckless Charge. This is a crap ton of Reckless Charges. Oh, Havoc! But Havoc's a skill. Yeah, it's hard. But before Wreck the Charge, there was what? Like, getting rid of the... Defense, defense there are actually probably pretty bad. So there's a 1 in 2 chance. Oh wait, it's a guaranteed corruption. Hello. Do I do it now? Do I just go for it? A little bit. We'll, we'll give it like a little whirl. Let's just see where we can take it. There's a reckless charge. I like that. That makes me happy. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so we got Fiend Fire with Corruption and Dead Branch. Fiend Fire is what I was talking about. That's an engine. It exhausts itself, but Fiendfire creates a brand new hand. Um, Market Pain, Sozu. So Sozu, Potion Bell was, you know, the, the legendary combo. It's, you know, talked about from, you know, Folktales years ago. Years ago, this Potion Bell, Sozu. If, you're, if you were lucky enough to get that, you were... I think we actually do Market Pain, but... I mean, I don't mind. I'm not going to really need potions, right? I'd rather not get the wounds. Get a lot of gold, though. So we have... Damn, we have one, two, three, four, five upgrades. Five campfires. I don't even need all that. I guess we can go for elites, right? One, two, three... We can go for... Let's go for a crazy amount of elites. This is just elite hunting. Let's go for three elites. It's probably overly ambitious. No, I don't think so. I think we're going to be totally fine. Okay, maybe we're not. <laughs> About that. I made a huge mistake. Oh, never mind. Never punished. Never punished. Lol. Oh, that's too good. Ah, oh, that's too good. I should've done Black Star. Yeah, you're right. That's true. 
Oh, I didn't want to get rid of Inflame. I thought that was, um, I didn't see that was True Grit. My bad. Fuck, I didn't want to get rid of Inflame. Demon form? I mean, don't mind if I do, actually. Disarm again? Oh my god. That wrench is too good, man. I love it. Oh, that's actually pretty sick. Inflame pummel into cleat into clash. Oh, that's pretty sick. Let's skip. Although I should just be I should be loading up my deck with skills, right? Like I should be adding crap ton of skills. And uh, you know, but then that makes it harder for me to get corruption. So like, if I can get corruption bottled, then I can try adding as many skills as I need in my deck. But only until then. What's up, Lucky Star? I'm doing, it's going pretty well. How you doing? Ah, uh, we have, we have a good chance here. Sick. 50-50, baby. 50-50. Shockwave is cool. Ritual Dagger? So, Ritual Dagger is an attack that gives me a dead branch. I'm intrigued. I get max HP? I'm intrigued. Bag of Prep? Yes, that's perfect to find Corruption. What about we buy, buy another Corruption? Just buy another Corruption. Now we don't have to worry about the problem of... Uh, Getting too many skills. We buy another corruption, get a sentinel, and just load up the deck with skills. There's also ice cream. Now ice cream can get kind of nutty because of seen red shenanigans. And sentinel, seen red shenanigans. And then you'd have a massive hit with whirlwind or whatever. Let's do ice cream sentinel. How do we do both cor two corruptions. Yeah, let's do two corruptions. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, because now we're gonna take a whole bunch of skills. Not like this, though. Okay, not like this. Damn it. All right, what do we got? Okay. Uh, we've got my choices a little bit. Oh, we got barricade. Oh, we got another barricade. Jesus Christ. Let's do this. Oh, hello. Funeral pain? Oh my, that, oh my word. That, that is what I want in my life. Yes, funeral pain is exactly what I want. Okay, we're all we're all good now. Another Jesus, they really want me to have barricade. Okay, but not right now because I can't really afford you. Come again now. Okay, you came again. Oh, you're, you're damn barricade. You really want to be Jesus. Just just hold on. Okay, I'll use you in a sec. Let me just get the energy. Oh, me and the bone. True grit. Oh, hey. Oh, what's up, guys? Hey, it's me, Corruption. How you doing? Don't worry, guys. This would be fun for me. Fiend fire, eh? There was once a man. You know what? I want to milk this a little bit. I want to milk this just a little bit. Just a little bit. And let's do that. And I should use. Damn. We have ice cream. Let's just do this. Oh, oh shit yet. Yeah. Oh, whoa. Whoa.
We're breaking the game. I'm breaking the game. We always do it with the corruption. I mean, it's been a while since we had a run like this, you know? It's, it's nice. Let's... I'm thinking Pummel... I mean, we decided we were gonna just load the deck up with skills, right? Because we have two corruptions. I mean, Pummel's cool, but I think we want to load it up with skills. And this could be Go Fiend Fire. I, I think it's nice. Pantograph, 666. First turn, get rid of... Okay, first turn, Fiend Fire. It's tempting. Because I also want to do True Grit, just get rid of the Rive and just save my behind a little bit. That's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 damage. 60 damage. Um... 60 damage, but then I probably take some damage to the face. It's not worth it. If I can get corruption out first, then yes. Oh, <laughs> speaking of corruption. I mean, like, I mean, I guess it's cool that we could, um, a ritual dagger, finally. Wait, let's try to find Exhum. This is super greedy, guys. We gotta find Exhum. Now, now I'm on a mission. Never mind. It's Havoc, yes. Let's upgrade this next trigger. All right. It's Havoc here. Uh, I'm not really liking this. Oh, okay. Oh, Fiend Fire would be really nice next turn. I'm down for that. Oh, not like this. Okay, I guess this is fine. <laughs> oh my. I really should have taken Black Star. But the, not having fun energy would have been a problem, in my opinion. Here's thing itself. All right, let's see what we got. Evolve would be nice. Let's evolve. Take care of the days for us. That's a sentinel that we just top decked really quickly, and no one saw a thing. Just a sentinel right there. Let's do double tap fiend fire. Just take a look. It shouldn't work, but it does. Oh, never mind. It doesn't work. Give me energy. Energy, please. Energy, please. Alright. I, I, I can kill him. I just need... Wait, I should wait for my uh, ritual dagger. Wait, I should wait for ritual dagger. Let me not get ahead of myself. We're gonna top deck it right now with Havoc. I'm gonna wait for it. I believe. There it is. Boom. Burning packs? Hey, it helps me find corruption. Now. Oh. This guy. You know what? He deserves this, actually. I'm gonna have that corruption out of the way. Let's get rid of that writh. Rit we got double uppercut. Let's do it. Let's 
become vulnerable. Who cares? <laughs> oh, my virtual dagger. Come on. Not like this. Let's get rid of the berserk. We don't want another one. Limit break. Ah, wait. Sentinel. I'm trying not to use Hemokinesis, but let's just go for it. Barricade, hello. Oh. I should have waited. I could have waited for Exhum to get Ritual Dagger, but it's too much work, right? Bottle Flame for Ritual Dagger. That's going to help us get it more often. I know it seems crazy. But by bottling the Ritual Dagger, I can actually try to make it... Well, not in this fight, but in hallway fights, I can try to get this scaled up. Alright, so this is going to be a... We have two corruptions, so we should find it inevitably. And then I, would, I will take the barricade in this fight. I will take the barricade if I can find it. Oh, if I could find it. I mean, the game, honestly... Sentinel Barricade. Just what I needed. I'll get rid of the second Corruption. We'll upgrade the Body Slam for our Barricade deck. Yeah, that sounds fun. <laughs> oh my god. What did they steal? I emulate. I should have saved the energy for ice cream. It's a lot of true grits. Let's get rid of that anger. Funeral pain. T pain. It's about weakness. Let's do that. I mean, at this point, we might as well just keep going, right? Because of Barricade. There is a, there's a fear of running out of uh, skills, but with Barricade, at least that is turning into block that I'm not losing, right? But I, I am... I could reach a point where I'm running out of stuff. But Reckless Charge saves that. So never mind. Oh, you know what? Really nice as well. Medkit and Immolate. So we can use the burns from Immolate. Why did I get rid of that? I'm not sure why I did that. We can use the burns. Oh, we're looking for Body Slam. Body Slam. <laughs> so we can use the burns from Immolate to create uh, Dark Invasive Exhum. So Exhum is insane because we use Exhum on. Sentinel or spot weakness. Uh, sorry, on scene better to Sentinel. Just keep going. Dark Embrace is a combo. But I think Exhum is nuttier. Calling Bell gives us max HP. I'm doing it. Charon's Ashes. Oh my god. Okay. Wow, which is the boss? Awaken one? Okay. It's gonna be fun. <laughs> That's gonna be fun. Let's do this way. Let's go for some leads. This is hilarious. It's funny because I said I was gonna do one more because of Anthony. And this is what turns out. The two rides suck though. I'm not enjoying those two revs. Oh. Wait a second. Wait a second. You know, they deserve this. They deserve this. And don't think of it any other way, alright? Whoever asked what Sharon's Ashes does, you probably can see what it does now.
I'm actually taking damage. Wow. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of both those writhes because my first turn is... It needs to be juicy. Wait, I should look for Exhum. Oh, now it's actually hard for me to look for Exhum to find my, uh... My ritual dagger. Ah, it doesn't matter. Three corruptions? I mean, we really make sure we gotta find it. I'm telling you, it's important. Let's fight. You see? It's important. Wait, I see ritual dagger here. Oh, it's so close to getting increased. Feels bad. So close. Alright, we gotta get rid of these rides. The first turn is kicking my ass. Fiendfire, wait, I need to get, like, energy. Give me energy of some sort. Uh... Energy of some sort, please. So I can do Fiendfire this turn. Oh, well, Charon's Ashes just wins. Oh my god. Shrug it off. So now we want to add as many skills as possible because we have three corruptions in the deck. Oh, hello. Oh. I really want to do Exhum to bring back my Mitchell Dagger. Like, I think that would be nice if I do that. Like, I know I could kill him right here with crazy ass. Alright, there you go. Fleenberry, yeah. So we get two more curses, but we get a lot of gold, right? And then we take that gold to these two shops, remove the two normality, but then that means we have to keep the curses we already have. But we might get blue candle. So what are the chances we get blue candle? Well, let's find out. We got bottle tornado, which is nice. Cause now I don't worry about the first turn anymore. Um and we got scene red as well. So bottle tornado's sick. Scene red's nice. I like the helix. I like the sling. Let's remove one of the normalities, of course. Let's not forget. Although, if I get Blue Candle in the next shop, let's find out. Um, let's upgrade... Uh, I don't know. Fiendfire. Membership card's nice, although, okay, we gotta... We can, if we do membership, we can still remove, right? Yeah, we can remove the normality. Okay, this is fine. So, we got rid of the normality, we got membership card, we got some nice relics. Like, that's totally fine. Because the rides and stuff like that, I don't care because I have Bottle Tornado now, so it's okay. And I can just do this. And I think we're pretty good now. Like, we were already good, but now we're, like, super good. Like, yeah. Yes, yes. It only goes up from here. Because we have Seen Red. And Sentinel. It's going to be a long one, boys. Buckle in. This guy's gonna feel it. Sorry, Rachel Dagger. It wasn't your time. Exhum. Exhum makes it nutty. Oh my. Eh. Let's just do it. See, see if we get lucky here. Let's see if we get lucky. With some energy. Eh, whatever. At least we have buffer, right? So we're not taking damage. We can actually bring back the barricade. Although, I think I'm going to kill him here. But we can bring back barricade with... Uh, the headbutt, but that's not going to matter because I can't draw. If we get card draw, then I'm going to do headbutt for barricade. So I'm hoping that we do this and get card draw.
I'm really hoping we get card draw here. Um. Well, I mean, I guess. Spin Strike is pretty good, huh? Okay, well, we got Barry Connection, but it's kind of too late because we don't. I'm gonna do it just in case. Just in case I run out of skills. Black if I took Black Shard, then my relics would be insane, but who knows how, how much more difficult it would have been. Probably not that much more difficult. Now it's got to play things and win. When exactly do I win? I think I got to... Uh, I think now we might be able to win. I'm not sure. I didn't do the math. Alright. Felt right. Shuriken. Demon form? I mean, it's overkill. I don't need demon form. I, I could have it, maybe. And the infinite blades is not bad, because infinite blades kind of just gives you more exhaust stuff. Just exhaust into exhaust. But um, I, I might just skip here. I mean, it's demon form plus, too. It, it, it helps, but not necessary. Against awaken one... Against awaken one, I don't think it's going to make a difference. I think the biggest thing that makes a difference is barricade, more so than anything. I'm not taking it. It's really Barricade that makes the biggest difference. Um, I don't really have that many good upgrades. I guess more card draw, right? But are we really bad up? I, I should do Dreamcatcher, actually. We can lose one Corruption. Is that the bottle one? It's not the bottle one, is it? It's actually fine. Uh... You can't lose bottle cards. Yeah, you can't. You can't. You're right. That's stupid of me to ask. I know. I know better. I know better. I want to try bringing back um, Ritual Dagger here. For me, it's like a mini game to see if I can get Ritual Dagger stacked up. I do have Ritual Dagger in my. I seen headbutt. Mm, too late. Fuck it. Okay. Havoc again, Entrench. Entrench is sick if I can get Barricade. I'm gonna rest, because I'd rather just take cards at this point. Body Slam is really good in this deck. I don't, this is a fight I need to be careful not to run out of skills because like I need to have barricade in this fight I need to hope that I can top deck barricade barricade is a guaranteed win um I'm actually like aggressively looking for barricade. But trigger that corruption. Trigger the parasite. Mm, I mean, I could just kill him this turn, I guess. Cause we we kind of do have body slam in our hands. So it is kind of tempting. When you have bodies in your hands. I could just kill him. Um, I guess we kind of do a little bit more though. We, we want to maybe find a barricade. So we can do a little bit more before we kill him. Let's get rid of some of these skills. And some of these attacks. Alright. Barricade would be fantastic. 
Get rid of some of these attacks. Uh, damn. I mean... Let's get rid of some of this stuff. Alright. Oh, maybe I should do Fiendfire to look for Barricade, huh? I should probably do Fiendfire instead to find Barricade. That was my bad. Oh! Pfft. A little late, buddy. Thank you. Alright. Carry on. Carry on. Everything's fine. And now you're coming in now you're coming all over the place, huh? That sounds a little weird. Phrasing. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna do entrench. And then we're gonna do Cyber Soul here. My god, this is like too much stuff. It's like. It's too much. It's too much. It's too easy to. It's too, it's too much winning, guys. I can't take it. Alright. Cool. Okay, what's up? Let's find. Fairy Kid for you. Okay. We didn't perfect him, unfortunately. I can't play as many infinite cards, so... This is actually a little bit harder, because if I don't find Barricade... Like, I can't just do infinite cards here. This is much trickier, actually. But I do have Ice Cream, so I could do Ice Cream to just make a really big Whirlwind. But things that are really strong against this guy would be, um... But speaking of whirlwinds, really strong stuff would be demon form and barricade. So we need both of those things. And that's the whirlwind as well. I mean, I could just do nothing. I could do nothing. And so demon form is nice. I should just probably do nothing at this point. I'm looking for disarm. I should do nothing though. I'll, I'll do. I will do dark embrace. All right. Funeral pain is really strong as well. Fiend fire is kind of sick. Although I kind of like the true grit that I just lost. Impervious. Uh, let's get rid of the doubt. And we'll do body slam. Eh. Let's do just let's, just, let's do Sever Soul. Th did he stop me midway? Oh. Whirlwind is a lot of damage. GG! Alright guys, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. I do want to come back and do some MTG. That was a crazy run. That was what happens when you have Dead Branch first relic of the game. I mean, you know, sometimes you get this and you just kind of kind of enjoy it. You get Sharon's Ashes and yeah, you enjoy it. 2,800! What the? Now, I almost had perfect on the time meter. That was a lot. I almost had a 3,000, I believe. That would have been close to 3,000. That is a high score. Yes, it is. 
We got curses because we have curses. We have five curses. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. How is it on the rank? Uh, the rank, I think the rank, the leader brothers are kind of... Oh, number 11. What's up, guys? If I didn't mess up time meter, we could have been top five? Not bad, guys, not bad. That's pretty cool. It's actually, these are all legit. These are all legit.